Way back in 1611, on a bitterly cold January morning in Prague, a snowflake landed on the sleeve of mathematician Johannes Kepler, and it got him thinking, why do snowflakes have six sides? Kepler's breakthrough was his theory that this hexagonal pattern is the most efficient use of space, whether it's a honeycomb within a beehive, or piles of stacked cannonballs, or a delicate, transient snowflake. It took 400 years, 400 years, for his theory to be proven. What Kepler didn't know at the time is that each molecule of water, or H2O, is made up of two hydrogen atoms and one oxygen atom. As the water molecules cluster together when they freeze, the angle between the hydrogen atoms is always approximately 105 degrees. And that gives us the six sides. At its heart, a snowflake is always a hexagon, but it can grow into all sorts of weird and wonderful shapes. Long and thin like a pencil, sharp like a needle, cylindrical like a bullet, or just occasionally triangular. The truth is though, most snowflakes are kind of, well, blob-like 